went camping one year at the Pines, their best man, Victor, introduced Steve to Tals and her friends. And while it's memorable now, at the time, they barely became acquaintances. Well, a few years later, Talia and Steve were both now single. So what a perfect time to do some matchmaking. I knew that they were both at Aaron and Shana's grand final barbecue, so I messaged Talia and said, is there any single men there today? And she said, no, Mum, just the usual crowd. I replied, any bald men? <laughs> With a bit of Dutch courage, Charles asked best man Victor if it was all right for her to make a move on Steve. <laughs> With his permission, she did. And they ended up having their first kiss sitting on an esky. Talia and Steve, all the very best for what this life has to offer and uh, we trust that this wedding day is a special one in the memories of all of us. To my daughter Talia, I just want to say how proud I am of you. You are a very family orientated person, very loving, caring person. You look beautiful today and you're beautiful every day. To my new son-in-law Steve, welcome to the family, you're a good egg. Take care of my little girl because I know where you live. <laughs> and it's great to have another Collingwood and Storm supporter in the family. You and Talia were made for each other and I'm so happy for you both. I know you'll enjoy the rest of your lives together, especially if you do everything she says without question. Everyone, please raise your glass. Cheers to my new son-in-law and my daughter, the most beautiful bride. <laughs> <laughs> 